Right, hi guys and welcome back to another video on PlanSwift. Alright, so for today's video, we're going to be still talking about calibration, but something a little bit different. Right, so in the previous video, we discussed on the issue of scaling and that scale button actually applies to the entire drawing itself. Right, but what happens when you have a drawing like this, who ha uh, which has multiple scales on a single page? Right, so not to worry, you don't have to reload uh, this drawing three times just because it has three different scales. But uh, what you will use is that you will use the crop as a new page function, which is found under your page, under crop as new page. So what will happen is that I will just crop out this particular section, right, which I know is 1 is to 30, so I can just place it here. 1 is the 30 part section individually, so it will come out as 1 on its own and the original itself will not be affected, right? So what I can do is that I can just go back, continue this again, so I can come in here, drag out this part, name it section AA, right? Separately, it will come out on its own. If I jump back to the drawing itself, I can also crop out as a new page over here. 1 is 200 part plans. Right, so once I, ha I, have, uh, I have extracted them out one by one, then I can proceed to scale just like any other uh, drawing that I have. So I can just place it here, 1 is to 1.8, zoom in here, select on the points, then done. Right, so I hope this has helped you out uh, when you, whenever you load in uh, PDFs that have more than one, uh, one scale. Uh, on the page itself. Right, thank you. I'll see you in the next video.